This is the book of Job, chapter 9, verse 24. The earth is given into the hand of the wicked. He covereth the faces of the judges thereof. If not, where and who is he? Brakatha Yahweh, Brakatha Yahweh Shai. Brakatha Yahweh, Brakatha Yahweh Shai. Yahweh is the name who the world ignorantly calls God. And Yahweh Shai is his son who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praise, glory, and honor to Yahweh, Bahasham, Hamashiach, Yahweh Shai, Baha, Racha, Kodash. Double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone, who rule well and labor in his word and doctrine as they are the true teachers for the nation of Yasharala on earth today. Peace, blessings, citations to the hopeful elect Akim out there. You know, your brother's pushing his word throughout the far corners of the earth, risking their life for Yahweh Basham, Yahweh Shai's sake. You know, to your few sisters who are doing the right thing, to you I say Shalom. And Adawan Ratazah, which means Lord willing, you know, so Lord willing, this lesson is edifying. Through the spirit and power of Yahweh Basham, Yahweh Shai. <coughs> so, came across another article, and it's from Forbes. You know, so it's a reputable article. Forbes. <laughs> And the headline reads, Report of massive new ozone hole threatening billions contains serious errors. Right, and that's the reason why I brought out Job 9 and 24. Alright. Because this man, you saw Edom, the so-called white man, the devil that the Bible speaks of, is not fit to rule and govern this planet and it's evident we see it the other nations see it and again it's high time our people you know so-called negroes latinos and native americans repent right because hey this man's kingdom is about to go bye bye It goes on to read, the mainstream narrative around the hole in the ozone layer of Earth's atmosphere is that it is located primarily over Antarctica, was greatly exacerbated by indus industrial chemicals like chlorofluorocarbons, and that new regulations starting in the 1980s have helped control the threat. But now a new study claims that a new year-round ozone hole has been detected over Earth's tropics potentially exposing billions of people to high doses of dangerous ultraviolet untra sorry ultraviolet radiation from the sun yeah all right and <laughs> hey once the ozone layer is gone <laughs> you know that gives again just like the article says it gives way to the ultraviolet radiation all right, from the yeah, from the sun. Just want to get a quick reset. This is a uh, Revelation eleven and eighteen. And the nations were angry, and thy wrath is come, and the time of the dead that they should be judged, and that thou shouldest give reward unto thy servants, the prophets, and to the saints, and them that fear thy name small and great and shouldest destroy them which destroy the earth right and that's this devil all right here we have <laughs> you know th that just proves this man's a virus because he he tests things you know that's why you have you know your chemtrails you know, animals going extinct. Holes in the ocean. Contaminated water. And, of course, holes in the ozone layer. You know, and the list goes on. Right? And that's why it's imperative to know the name of the Lord and His Son, Yahweh. Wah, Yahweh Shai. Alright? So we get back to the article. The 
goes on to read, the existence of the tropical ozone hole may cause a great global concern. A scientist from the University of Waterloo in Ontario, the depletion of the ozone layer can lead to increased ground level UV radiation, right, which can increase risk of skin cancer and cataracts in humans, as well as a weaken human immune systems, decrease agricultural productivity, and negatively affect sensitive aquatic organisms and ecosystems, right? You know, because the, the, the Lord knows what he's doing. He set, when he created everything, he set everything in order. All right? And that's just plain. Um, I, I thought I'd look at, you know, radioactive effects. You know, on human body. Even though the article mentioned it, it does read radiation can damage the DNA in our cells. High doses of radiation can cause acute radiation syndrome or cutaneous radiation injuries. High doses of radiation could also lead to cancer later in life. Alright. So not only does it just harm us, it also harms animals and again the earth. Alright. You know, if this man was to continue ruling, <laughs> it would no longer be here. Alright. That reminds me, this is uh, Lamentations, chapter 3, verse 22. It is of the Lord's mercies that we are not consumed, because his compassions fail not, right? You know, this devil, you know, if it was up to him, man, there would be not a single life left. Here it is, he wants to, you know, go to the moon, go to other planets, discover life on other planets. He says he's discovered, going to, uh, I forgot his statistics, like, what is it? 70% approximately of the ocean is discovered or something like that but if you don't know 100% how can you <laughs> discover 70% that's ridiculous you know you know we should be stewards of the earth all right You know, every day this this man is being revealed. So I thought I'd take a look at the word steward. Steward. From Oxford Dictionary Online, Google. And it goes into a person employed to look after the passengers on a ship, aircraft or train. A person responsible for supplies of food to a college, club or other institution. Supervise arrangements or keep order at a large public event, manage or look after another's property. And what's it, what they, what do they all have in common? All the definitions to look after, right? You know, to manage to res be responsible. You know, and this devil's irresponsible. This is uh, Genesis chapter 1. Verse 26, and the Most High said, Let us make man in our image after our likeness, and let them have dominion over the fish of the sea, and over the fowl of the air, and over the cattle, and over all the earth, and over every creeping thing that creepeth upon the earth. Alright. Verse 27, so the Most High created man in his own image. In the image of the Most High created he him, male and female created he them. The Most High blessed him, and the Most High said unto said unto them be fruitful and multiply and replenish the earth and subdue it and have dominion over the fish of the sea and over the fowl of the air and over every living thing that moveth on the earth right and this earth is out of course you know it's, it's defiled more than <laughs> worse than it's ever been all right came across another article recently and 
and it's from the sun and it goes on to read beast of the deep russia launches longest ever submarine designed to carry nuclear torpedo drones that spark radioactive tsunamis right and that's the times that we're, we're coming to you know we're just waiting for the mandatory implementation of the digital old the MOTB the rice grain under the skin the surveillance under the skin you know, you've got to use all these code words all right because that has to be made mandatory first all right as well as famine of the word Jacob's trouble you know and this is the year uh, of Yahweh Basham Yahushai turning up Dean's by Apostle Taha and indeed it has been you know just over halfway through this this year year 2022 AD which really we don't even know what year we're in alright because this devil's you know he sought to change the times it's the book of Daniel chapter 7 verse 25 and he shall speak great words against the most high and shall wear out the saints of the most high and who's the he Esau Edom and think to change times and laws and they shall be given into his hand until a time and times and the dividing of time right you know we could be in the year 1999 Right, and again, we're here prophesying to our people. You know, you must repent because, hey, this devil's time is is coming to a quick and abrupt end. So back to the article that came out, eighth uh, of July, twenty twenty-two. The Russian Navy today took delivery of its giant city killer submarine designed to unleash a radioactive tsunami with apocalypse drones the Belgorod which at 604 feet is the longest sub ever built in the world is claimed to be ready to enter service after successful trials see that it's just a few images of of the submarine and its uh, its capability, city killer. All right, this goes to show that the Lord is a man of war, pursuant to Exodus fifteen and three. So the Lord is in control. All right, you know the Lord, He controls the minds of these of these leaders. You get that. Proverbs 21 Proverbs 21 and 1 The king's heart Heart meaning mind The Hebrew word lab Alright The king's heart is in the hand Of the Lord Yahweh As the rivers of water He turneth it Whithersoever he will Every way of a man is right In his own eyes But the Lord pondereth the hearts There you go So Hey the Lord put the spirit on On Putin You know on these uh, generals all right to test their their nuclear capability all right you know they didn't just oh get up one day and thought you know i want to develop you know a submarine put it into you know into a into play into motion to test it you know and that cuts free will All right, the Lord is the best chess player, <laughs> and you know that it goes to show that Mother Russia is going back into that spirit of, you know, of the USSR, as well. You know, and Babylon the Great, aka the United States of America, that's going to be completely one hundred percent decimated with nukes all right and laser beam from the chariots lake of fire you know world war three is really close it's brewing up that's why it's imperative to watch what's going on in the middle east 
All right. All right. Go back to the article. You know, because the Lord's going to have, you know, you, <laughs> you nations in the valley of Jehoshaphat. All right. In the Hebrew, Yahweh Shapat, Yahweh's judgment. All right. So if we read on, the article it reads The 14,700 ton war machine was made even longer so it can carry the new devastating nuclear tipped Poseidon torpedoes guided by artificial intelligence. See, wisdom wiser than Daniel. See that? Developing these. <laughs> you know, you've got AI that control these. Now, if you go back, you know, to, uh, you know, the first submarines that were made, of course, they didn't have that. Didn't have AI for that. I'm sure they wouldn't. All right. Of course, technology increase. It also has Bond villain-style secret compartments to launch mini-subs and drones for covert sabotage and spying ops, such as cutting undersea cables. But shipbuilders, Sevmash and Naval Top Brass stressed only its research capabilities at a handing over ceremony today. Despite previous boasts of its fearsome weaponry, today state news agency TASS reported the sub was designed to solve diverse scientific problems. <laughs> this is for war. Alright. And hey, the world is in for a rude awakening, but only the elect of the nation of Israel. Are not, are not going to be deceived. All right. This is the book of Ezekiel thirty-eight, in verse one. And the word of the Lord Yahweh, Bahasham Yahushai, came unto me, saying, "Son of man, set thy face against Gog, the land of Magog, the chief prince of Meshech, and Tubal, and prophesy against him." Now, Meshech is Moscow, and Moscow is the capital city of Russia. Verse 3, And say, Thus saith the Lord Yahweh, Behold, I am against thee, O God, the chief prince of Meshech and Tabu. You know, and ultimately the Lord is against Russia, but he's just using them as a tool to destroy Babylon the Great. Verse 4, And I will turn thee back and put hooks in thy jaws, and I will bring thee forth and all thine army, horses and horsemen, all of them clothed with all sorts of armour, even a great company with bucklers and shields, all of them handling swords. Persia, Ethiopia and Libya with them, all of them with shield and helmet. Gomer and all his bands, the house of Togomar, of the north quarters and all his bands and many people with thee. Be thou prepared and prepare for thyself. Thou and all thy company that are assembled unto thee, and be thou a guard unto them. Right, so Russia's gonna spearhead this thing. Alright, you know, let the weak say I'm strong. All these nations, these weaker nations, right, you know, they're, they're becoming stronger. Okay, you know, these modern day. You know, swords, these ICBM missiles, and that's the spirit that Russia is going back into. And there's no stopping this through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Alright, so, you know, it behoove you to repent. It's a little bit more on the article, but I'm going to leave it there, so, you know, I don't want to rattle, which means Lord willing, this lesson was edifying. Alright, again, double honours to the apostles of Great Millstone, who rule well and labour in this word and doctrine, the 100% truth. You know, so, love you, Akim, waf you, Akwathium. You know, keep praying, keep fighting, keep pushing, keep studying. Alright, because we're almost out of here. And with that, let's say Shalawam, Shalawam to the elect.